Hi viewers, I hope you all are doing fine. Today we will solve a sum related to the topic algebra. So the question here is AB is equals to 20, BC is equals to 30, AC is equals to 40. We have to find out A plus B plus C is equals to, we have to find out, right? So this is the question. Now we will solve this question step by step. So the first step is we will do multiplication here. Let's see AB, AB into BC. BC into AC is equal to C. AB, the value of AB is 20. The value of BC is equal to 30. And the value of AC is equal to 40. Now, we will multiply this way. A into B into B into C into A into C. So 20 into 30 into 40. If we multiply these three numbers, we will get the answer 24,000, right? So we'll write here 24,000. So the next step is we will multiply it twice. See, A into A and into B into B into C into C. So we will get 24,000. We have two, two digits here, no? A and A. So instead of writing two times, we will put here A square into B square into C square. We will get 24,000. Right? Now, we will further simplify this. A into B into C, the whole square is equals to 24,000. Now, a into B into C is ABC. ABC, the whole square is equals to 24,000. Now, ABC, the whole square. If it is in the square form, we will take it as square root. Square root ABC. The whole square. Now, we will cancel the square and the square. So, what is left? ABC is equals to 24,000. Now, ABC is equal to, we will shift the square root as 24,000. It is square root of 24,000. Now, we have to find out the square root of 24,000. How, how will we find? We will find by doing LCM. So, the LCM is 24,000, right? We will do the LCM step by step. First, we will take 2. 2 ones are 2, 2 twos are 4 and 3 zeros down. Now, 2, 6 are 12 and 3 zeros down. See, 12 will go, 2, 6 are 12, right? Now, the next number is, we will take 2. 2, 3 are 6 and 3 zeros down. Now, the next number we will take is 2 once again. 2, 1 is 2. 1 will get the remainder here. So, 2, 5 is 10 and 0, 0. Now, the next number we will take is, we will take 5. 5 3 is 15 and 0 0. Now the next number we will take is 3. We can take 3. We can take 5 also, right? Let's take 5 only. 5, how much are 30? 5 6 are 30 and 0. Now the next number we will take is 5 again. 5 1s are 5. 1 will get the remainder. We'll take 5 2s are 10. Now the next number we will take is 2. Because 2, 6 are 12, 2, 3 are 6 and 3, 1 are 3, right? So, we are done with the LCM. Now, what are, we have partners here, right? 2 and 2 is one partner, 2 and 2 is one partner, 5 and 5 is one partner. We don't have a partner for the other 5, right? 2 and 2 is one partner. So, what is left? 5 and 3. So, we will take here 2 into 2, 2, 2 are gives you 4 and here 2, 2 are 4, right? So, 2 2's are 4 and 2 2's are 4. So we will get 2 2's are 4 here and 4 here. So we will multiply this to 4 4's are 16. Even here we have 2 2's are 4, right? 4. So 2 4 into 4 is 16. 16 into 4 is how much? 16 into 4 is 64. So we will put here square root 64 into, now what is left? 5 into 5, right? So 5 5's are is 25, right? 
so we will write here 25 into what is left 5 and 3 is left alone so we will multiply 5 and 3 so 5 into 3 is 15 5 3 is a 15 right now we will take a b c is equals to 64 now what is the square root of 64 if we multiply what two numbers we'll get 64 8 right because 8 is a 64 we'll take here 8 into 5 is a 25 right so the square root of 25 is 5 into 15 we don't have we don't have any square root for 15 right so we'll write here square root of 15 we can't simplify that now the next step is we will write here a b c right a b c is equals to 8 into 5 8 5 is a 40 40 square root is 15 square root of 15 now we have to find out the value of a first we have to get a plus b plus c right first we'll find out the value of a so a is equals to a into b into c by b c now a is equals to what did we get here a b c a b c is equals to 40 root 15 right 40 square root of 15 now the value of b c is how much here according to the question the value of b c is equals to 30 right so we will write we will put 30 in the denominator now we will simplify this we will cancel this zero and this zero so what is left therefore the value of a therefore a is equals to 4 square root 15 by 3 is our value of a now next we have to we have to find out the value of b right we found out the value of a now we'll find the value of b so we'll found out we'll find out the value of b here b b is equals to the formula is b into ac divided by ac see b is equals to b into a into c is nothing but abc right so we'll put here abc by ac now what is the value of abc see the value of abc we got 40 to the root square root 15 right 40 square root 15 now divided divided by ac the value of ac according to the question is 40 so we'll cancel this 40 and this 40 what is left square root 15 therefore root 15 right therefore b is equals to root 15 now we got the value of a here we got the value of b now what is left we have to find out the value of c so c is equals to c into a b by a b c c is equals to c into a into b is nothing but a b c so c is equals to a b c divided by a b now what's the value of a b c we got here a b c is equals to 40 root 15 the value of a b according to the question is 20 so we'll put here 20 cancel 1 0 and 1 0 from here 2 1s are 2 2 2 are 4 so what is left therefore the value of c is equals to 2 root 15 is our answer so now we got the value of a b and c now we have to find out a plus b plus c so we'll write here a plus b plus c is equals to question mark right now we have to find out a the value of a is in place of a we'll write 4 root 15 divided by 3 plus what is the value of b the value of b is root 15 plus what is the value of c 2 square root 15 that's it right now we have to find how much we will get see if there is nothing in the denominator we'll put 1 here and here also we'll put 1 now we'll take out the lcm lcm of these 3 is 3 itself now we will multiply 3 into 1 here also we'll copy the same 1 into 3 1 into 3 we'll copy the same up now 4 square root 15 into 1 is 4 to the root 15 plus 15 square root 15 into 3 is how much we will get 3 to the square root 15 plus 2 into 3 2 3 is a 6 6 to the square root 15 we got 
this right now we will do the addition here how will we do the addition for these square roots simple we'll take out these numbers 4 plus 3 plus 6 and square root 15 see we have 3 square roots 15 right root 15 we have 3 so we'll write it once here now 4 plus 3 plus 6 gives you 13 as your answer so 13 square root 15 by 3 is our final answer even here we'll put in the denominator 3 therefore a plus b plus c is equals to three is our answer so the value of a plus b plus c is equals to this so this is our final answer that's all for today if you all found it helpful please subscribe like and share thank you for watching